This is the rapidly deployable aerial surveillance system called the RDAS. It includes everything required to rapidly deploy a UAV surveillance system into the air. The system includes everything required in this Pelican case, waterproof Pelican case, and also it includes the tripod. This is a very nice heavy duty tripod with extendable legs so we can get this unit and the monitor up high and, and in a good viewable area while you're flying the UAV. The uh, tripod itself has all the different adjustments for tilt and your viewing. Within this case is everything that's required, as I said, for field deployable. You go ahead and pull out the monitor and the antenna for the monitor. It locks into place. It's got a very, very high-end mount, so you don't have to worry about having anything fall off your tripod. Once the uh, tripod and the monitor is set up, we simply pull the radio out. This is our transmitter radio. This is how we will, uh, what we will use to fly the UAV itself. Then pull this out of the case. I have the antenna for the UAV. As we pull the UAV out, go ahead and close the lid here. This makes for a nice little flat landing and take off pad. The uh, antenna to the UAV screws on right here. And the GoPro 3 Plus camera system and the gimbal mount up here, power on the camera, start the video mode of it. Once we're ready to apply power, the battery is mounted here on the UAV with a high intensity LED that's going to give us um, power up sequences. Um, that it's going to go through its self calibration process and will also show us indication of locked onto satellites. Next thing we do before we apply power is we turn the transmitter radio on. And then we simply connect our battery source to the UAV itself. Once we do this, again, we'll go through a power on self check. The calibration process you'll see some red lights there um, that indicates that we still don't have full GPS lock on yet once the GPS system does fully lock on we typically range uh, at minimum five six seven satellites uh, we, we typically get anywhere in kind of open space we can typically get up to 11 12 13 satellites locked on once we see an indication of some green flashing lights then we will be fully locked on um, to GPS and we'll be ready to start it up. The unit itself, there's our green lights. Um, the unit itself, as you can see, is all, all carbon fiber and 3D printed material. Very, very high tech and, and sturdy material. To start the UAV, um, we simply pull these two sticks down into the corners. The UAV will launch itself and then hover in place. That's a, the uh, rapidly deployable aerial surveillance system can be deployed in about three minutes.